In Dallas, a tragic incident unfolded late Thursday night when three police officers were shot during a confrontation with a suspect. After a highway chase, it all began when Dallas police swiftly responded to an officer distress call, only to discover one officer injured in a patrol car as they engaged with the suspect, who emerged from his vehicle, wielding a long gun. Two more officers were shot. The injured officers were quickly rushed to local hospitals, where one officer tragically lost their life. The other two officers are currently in critical and stable condition. The suspect fled the initial scene, leading authorities on a pursuit to Louisville, Texas, located approximately 25 miles northwest of Dallas. However, the suspect's attempt to escape came to a deadly end when responding officers shot him after he exited his vehicle with a firearm, ultimately resulting in his death. The identities of the officers involved have not yet been disclosed. Dallas Mayor Eric Johnson expressed his deep sorrow over the loss, honoring the fallen officer as a hero and stressing the inherent dangers faced by law enforcement members. Furthermore, Mayor Johnson emphasized that the attack on the officers serves as an attack on the city and its values. The investigation into this heartbreaking incident is still ongoing. In a show of respect and remembrance for the fallen officer, the Dallas police have announced that flags at city facilities will be flown at half staff. Police spokesperson Kristen Lohman acknowledged the immense pain felt within the department, recognizing both the injuries suffered by officers and the profound loss of a valued colleague.